Wolfgar the abandoned husky had spent a long time wandering the lonely streets, but his life was about to change when news of his situation reached a kind couple. What kind of past had he endured, and would he ever be able to trust people again? Welcome to Wonderbot Animals. Sometimes, adopting a dog can be a roll of the dice. It is almost impossible to know what a dog has been through before you make him part of your family. You can't always know if he has been abused, has had to live on the streets, or has had unusual experiences that may influence his behaviour. Although some shelters can help with these questions, they rarely know all the answers. This was the case with the Husky Wolfgar, a dog with a mysterious and complicated past. Fortunately for him, and for the couple who adopted him, all he needed was a little love and care to undergo an incredible transformation. In November 2015, an Imgur user and her husband had heard about a stray husky wandering around her neighbourhood. They were intrigued to learn more about this dog and ventured out to see it for themselves. When they finally made contact with the dog, it was clear that he needed help. He was deeply frightened of all people, but especially of the woman's husband. In a post, the couple wrote, As you can see, he is in very bad shape in this photo. Note the uneven fur and visible ribs. He also had a large scar running through his ribs. The couple decided to take in the dog and named him Wolfgar. They knew that the next step would be to take him directly to the vet to see what needed to be done to make him much better. According to the couple, a normal male husky weighs between 45 and 60 pounds, depending on his height. When we weighed him at the vet, he weighed less than 39 pounds. The vet said he should weigh between 50 and 55 pounds. Not only was Wolfgar dangerously underweight, but his fur had been extremely damaged while he was on the streets. Wolfgar's newly adopted parents commented that he had demodectic mange. Huskies have two coats, so to have such red, dry, blotchy skin, he must have been infected for some time. Our poor pup probably suffered for months. His immune system was also terrible, so Wolfgar was prescribed antibiotics and medicated shampoos. Fortunately, he had neither worms nor fleas. After a thorough and enlightening review, it was time for the couple to take the dog home and begin the transition period in his new home. As soon as they reached their destination, they prepared a kennel for him to sleep in. They reported that he entered without difficulty, leading us to believe that he had been previously house-trained. We are not sure what has happened or where he came from. He didn't have a chip, not that we would have returned him anyway. The couple had some theories as to why Wolfgar had been living on the streets. However, they believed that he had escaped from an abusive and neglectful owner, which could also explain his scar. Furthermore, his distrust of men also supported this theory. It took some time for Wolfgar to get used to his new surroundings, and he spent his first few nights crying in his kennel. Unfortunately, the couple could not leave him in his room at night due to his scabies. During the first days of being in his new home, Wolfgar could not stop sleeping. Not only did he sleep in his kennel, but there was room for him everywhere. He looked like he was resting for the first time. Before we continue with this story, like this video to help it reach 14k likes, share and subscribe to our channel. The couple thought this was because he was exhausted from his ordeal and now he could snooze peacefully without fear. Now, he sleeps mostly in his kennel or on a soft blanket in the living room, the couple wrote. Over time, Wolfgar seemed to feel more and more comfortable in his new home and with his new owners. He even began to notice and appreciate the little luxuries his new life offered. According to the owners, it's been another week and he's staring at a treat in my hand. Sometimes, it's the only way to get him to look at the camera. It seems getting him to eat wasn't a big problem. Although the owners were hesitant at first for numerous reasons, they decided to take Wolfgar to the dog park for the first time, under supervision of course. They were especially concerned about how he would react to other dogs after being on the street and they hoped he wouldn't get into trouble. As is typical of Huskies, he was friendly and playful with other dogs. This was a great relief to the owners and a sign that all would be well and that Wolfgar would adapt quickly. At the dog park, the cutest thing happened. 
Wolfgar fell into the pond and didn't realize it. Luckily, the owner was lucky enough to take this photo right before he shook and got her wet. This is interesting behavior for a dog that had been rescued from the street just a few weeks earlier. Things were looking up for Wolfgar and his owners were excited to see what he would surprise them with next. While still at the dog park, the owner continued taking majestic photos of Wolfgar to document his incredible recovery. It's great to see a dog that has been through so much enjoy the life of a healthy, loved puppy. At one point, he might have observed other happy dogs at the dog park, but now he was one of them and he couldn't be happier. He was relaxed, confident and on track for a full recovery. The owners commented on this photo of Wolfgar with other dogs, saying the following about his behavior. He plays well with most other dogs, as long as they are also friendly. Since then, we have encountered dogs that are aggressive or bark at him. He is very calm when it comes to huskies, so he never barks. Most of the time, he just stares in a confused manner. This is incredible considering all the fights or brawls he has been involved in while surviving on the streets. It shows that his spirit is not lost. He has not broken. Of course, as friendly as Wolfgar was to other dogs, not everyone wanted to return the kindness. From time to time, Wolfgar would encounter a dog who made it clear that he did not want to be friends with it. In this case, the couple wrote, This husky shepherd mix wasn't too friendly. Luckily, Wolfgar didn't seem too bothered by it. Certainly, Wolfgar had encountered dogs and other animals much more intimidating during his time on the road. However, that didn't stop him from making friends. Although Wolfgar had many encounters with other dogs at the dog park, it was time to meet his owner's in-laws husky. When he did, he still seemed quite reserved. Notice how his tail is still sparse here. It was clear that Wolfgar was still traumatized in some way by his past experiences. However, after a while, Wolfgar made it very clear that he wanted to become friends with the other husky. Over time, Wolfgar's fur began to fill in the patches where his irritated skin had been exposed. As his fur grew, his owners noticed that his color was beginning to change. His fur had originally been a light red color, but was now starting to turn grayer and even looked like dark copper in the sunlight. So now, not only emotionally, but also physically, Wolfgar seemed like a completely different dog. Just over a month after the couple adopted Wolfgar, he had become a completely different dog. He was no longer as shy or timid as when they first welcomed him into his house. They also discovered some of his favorite activities, one of which was driving. By now, he had also managed to gain a little weight, although he still had a long way to go in that regard. Although the couple thought that Wolfgar's penchant for naps was mainly due to exhaustion from his experience of being adopted, they soon learned that it was simply part of his personality. The couple wrote that if there was one thing in the world that Wolfgar liked more than making friends and riding in the car, it had to be taking a nap. If dogs feel threatened, they never expose their belly, so the fact that Wolfgar sleeps in this position means that he is happy and at peace. As Wolfgar's fur grew thicker and he slowly regained his weight, his owners realized how much he liked to watch others. They stated that he loves going to the garden, he likes to sit and watch other people in the neighborhood. When people got too close, he would bark. He liked this protective look, although he was much more demanding with strangers now. It is nice to think that Wolfgar was only trying to protect his beloved family. Regarding this image, the owners commented, he could stand like a normal dog, but meh. This is Wolfgar doing his thing, which makes him feel comfortable. He may look like a cat, but we all know that he is not a cat at all. It's another sign that he's doing great in his new home and feels comfortable enough to do whatever he wants. While this may seem like an interesting way for a dog to eat, we've certainly seen stranger things. With each passing day, Wolfgar grows healthier. Even in this photo, you can see how much he has changed since he was adopted from the street. Now, his fur has even started to turn almost black. The owner noted that you can really see how his fur has darkened in this photo. I hope it's just a winter coat, as I loved the red coloring on him. In any case, we are glad that he is recovering without problems. 
Like many dogs, Wolfgar likes to relax on the cool tile floors at home, especially after a long day at the dog park. Sometimes, he can't even keep his eyes open when he is lying on the tiles, like in this photo. That day, he must have gotten a lot of exercise at the dog park. It's good to know that he is getting the exercise that every dog Wolfgar's size needs to be healthy. He seems like a happy dog. Not all dogs are as enthusiastic as Wolfgar when it comes to getting into the car, but it is one of his favorite things. When the car door opens, he jumps in, ready to get out. No matter where they go, he just likes to be with them during the trip. Since the owners knew nothing of his past, it must have been surprising to discover how much he liked to drive. Plus, it's something they can indulge in without too much effort. Can you guess where she knows he's going when he gets in the car? Since the dog park is close to the owner's home, they visit it regularly. Along the way, they make sure to roll down the windows so Wolfgar can take in all the sights and smells as they head to his favorite spot. Owners love the proximity of the dog park so they can exercise Wolfgar regularly and give him the social experiences he needs to grow as a dog. Believe it or not, Wolfgar has even memorized the route to the dog park. Now that's dedication. According to his owners, when we get close, he starts moaning and jumping in the back seat excitedly. We all know that this behavior is not just common for Wolfgar, as most dogs lose their minds at the leash signal. However, it is proof that, regardless of his unfortunate past, he is just like any other dog today. Along with the thickening and color changes in their fur, other differences in their physical appearance are their height and, above all, their tail. While before he was so thin and hairless, now he is lively and full of hair, signs of a healthy and self-confident dog. Over the course of a few months, everything, from his mannerisms to his appearance, has undergone a major transformation. Neither the owners nor the pup could be happier about this. During the initial phases of Wolfgar's adoption process, the couple had no idea how well he would fit into the family. Today, his worries can be put to rest because he has adapted perfectly. He even felt comfortable enough to start breaking some of the family rules, like the no-eating-people policy for the dogs. We are sure that this is not the first time that Wolfgar has stuck his nose where he shouldn't. They are the eyes of a dog that appreciates everything that has happened to him since he was adopted. If you compare the photos from when he was born and the current ones, they look like two completely different dogs. Here he is, serene and happy, whereas just a few months before he was shy and fearful. Not only is he a handsome boy, but those eyes are enough to melt anyone's heart. About this photo, the owners commented, My favorite photo of him. He is now a happy, healthy and pampered dog, and we adore him and all the hair he leaves on our clothes. This photo is proof that even the worst dogs just need a little love and care to be rehabilitated. We are very happy that Wolfgar has gone from being a dog that suffered on the streets to being the light of this couple's life. He now lives comfortably and is happy, as any dog should be. Have you ever adopted a stray animal and witnessed their transformation? What challenges have you experienced introducing a rescue pet to other animals? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to like, share and hit that notification bell for more stories like this. See you next time!